Have you have you read all of Mein Kampf? Have you read the whole dictionary from cover to cover? <laughs> I mean, that's the stuff that life is made of. And you can say, yes, I've read the whole dictionary and then I read it backwards. Well, that is, <laughs> that's the show. Well, to start off, I would love to hear from both of you. Um, Tati, if you would like to start, what were you first imagining when you heard that there was going to be this non-linear TV series? Um, What was I first imagining? I just was very excited by it. The fact that you could, like, as an audience member on my own, I'm always excited by stories that make me think, stories that I have to do a little bit more in order to get the gratification of what this this piece was. Um, so when I first heard that it was nonlinear, I was like, oh, that's awesome. So every person that watches it is gonna have a completely different experience, which I think creates for, for just such, enriching conversation around it and and allows everyone to walk away with a very personal experience, I think. Um, and so I was was excited and enticed by that. And then of course, enticed by, from an actor's standpoint of like, okay, we get eight episodes all at once, all at a time. Where it, like, and finding, my character finding Hannah through all of that, and how I can plug in certain things now. Now that I'm informed by her, pretty much, you know, her life of over 24 years, how can I drop this nugget here? How can I uh, charge this moment with this person? How can I um, uh, uh, just create a a a more layered character than I than I think that I've I, I've ever had to tackle, um, and. Yeah, I, I was just just very excited about the nonlinear structure, and I think that it that it offered so much. Um, and I think that still, I'm I'm discovering the more things that it can offer. I love what the long, when I when I first heard this was going to be done this way, I, I picked my brain to think, what does this mean? And, and certainly, and, and and much of many of the questions that have been asked today, and one that you are asking once again is uh, generally. What did you think about that? How did that make you feel? So all of a sudden I'm sitting here struck with the idea that I've been living in how it makes me feel. But I remember the moment when I first read the first two that I wondered how it would make the audience feel. And all of a sudden I realized that if I were an audience watching a show I was not in that was a non-linear linear format, I would feel like I am making up the story myself. And so to me, I think it's genius because I'm making this movie. I'm It's ownership over what the structure is. I can choose orange, green, white, red, violet. And it gives me the power and the sense that I'm partially telling the story that I want to see. And that to me is phenomenal. But was there anything about the format that that was particularly challenging as actors? Um, was there anything, you know, that you struggled with because of the, the nonlinear aspect? Um, it was tricky just having to, or I guess not tricky, but that's what also made it fun was having to remember certain things at different at different times. Um, and in hoping that you do remember everything in any given moment so that you can give the most to every moment. Um, at least that's for me, that's 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 where the, the the hardest part was like, sometimes like I never wanted there to be a moment where I walked off of set and I was like, oh dang, I forgot this thing that I could have just like brought in a little bit here because it would have been really nice to see that here. Um, so yeah, I, I just wanting to make sure that I, I knew Hannah backwards and forwards. Um, yeah, was probably the the only challenge uh, uh, for me. Um, for me, I was always jealous because the younger minds seemed to grasp the timeline a little bit quicker than I did. And so for me, it was my daughter walking into the room at, at Stay K Hotel when she visited me for dinner and I had a seven foot table and literally, Papa, what is all this? And I'm like, well, what are you doing? And I'm like, all eight episodes are laid out on the table. I'm trying to make a connection. And then I finally realized, you know, you can, you can, you can know it all and you can connect to it all, allow it to be present and right there in the moment. And, but yes, it was a challenge to let your brain go and trust yourself that you had the whole atlas in front of you. 
And believe me, when people ask you, you know, when I was in school, they ask you, have you read the whole Atlas? Have you have you read all of Mein Kampf? Have you read the whole dictionary from cover to cover? <laughs> I mean, that's the stuff that life is made of. And you can say, yes, I've read the whole dictionary and then I read it backwards. Well, that <laughs> that's the show. You know, and so it's always great to be in a place of wonder and 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 in a place that that is so accepting, vulnerable, and and in service of. You know, I have to say in this show more than any in a long time. I mean, Breaking Bad, Better Call Saul, in service to that great writing of Vince Gilligan. On this, I gotta say, another master has been brought to the forefront of our visual consciousness, and that's Eric Garcia. Right. Mm -hmm. Because a guy who could take a, take his vision, uh, write it and then have other people collaborate with him in the great writers room and create something that has such depth and is so much fun. Don't forget, we're, we're talking characters. We're actors. All we want to talk about is character. But this sucker has some action in it, too. <laughs> you know what I mean? People are messing with each other. People are, 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 are beating on each other. People are shooting each other because of the want that they that they they're trying to get something. So everything's informed by a character relationship that's so very strong and powerful. Uh, I think that this is an undeniable show, coupled with the fact that you can make up your own movie. Man, what 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 else could you ask for? Awesome. All right. Well, thank you, guys. I'm going to have to wrap. But yeah, thanks for chatting with me about the series. No, thank you. Have a good one.